What's up guys, welcome to today's video. Today, what we're gonna focus on is cutting thick bangs to make them fall nice and soft. So what I do is I take a side parting and then I go diagonal forward and I bring that section up across her face over to me and I do a technique called tease cutting. Now I'm gonna break that down for you guys. It's a half close of the scissor and I push into the hair and it just cuts it little by little and it creates a really, really soft line which you can see right there as it falls. It falls nice and light which is great for thick hair. So I keep taking that diagonal forward parting, bringing the hair over to me. Now the higher I lift it in the air, the lighter the section will fall. So where the challenge usually is, is on the opposite side temple area. That hair usually falls over and it's too heavy. Well, that all comes from that elevation and then combining it with the tease cutting technique makes it nice and light. So you can see, I just tease through it, cut my section, pinch the hair in my hand, and then I get a nice uh, light result falling to the other side. Now. As I get across the head shape and I get to that temple area, this is where I wanna shift where I'm pulling the hair to. Now I just pull it straight out in front of me and I cut it with that tease cutting technique, which again, will make it nice and light, but I don't need to elevate it over the head because that would make it too light and it would make it not fall uh, uniform with the rest of the haircut. So just continuing through, pulling it out to the front of the face, doing that tease cutting technique through it. So now that helps us take care of that heavy side. Now we're gonna go on to the lighter side and I'm gonna do the same technique. The only difference is less elevation. I just do a little bit of cutting just to blend it in, but that's all you have to do. Is just bring it all out and cut it. So now that we've got the cut portion out of the way, now we're gonna go in and style it. So what I'm doing is I'm styling it the same way that I cut it. So I take that diagonal forward section, I bring it across the head and I, curl it the opposite direction of where she's gonna wear it. And what that's gonna do is give me that extra volume and a little extra flip in the end result. So you'll see that coming up real soon. So again, curl it the opposite direction she's gonna wear it. And then when you comb it out, you'll get a nice little flip. So you'll see, I take my Ergo Diamond Head Paddle Brush. I brush the hair over. You can already see that flip starting to happen. Obviously, I'm gonna add a little bit of hairspray in there. Uh, to give it that nice hold, but you can see that curve, that movement, but also notice the haircut, guys. You can style this any way you want. You can style it with volume in the bangs, however you want to do it, but the reality of it is it's a nice light fringe, and that's what we wanted to achieve, and that's what we did in this cut. So look at how nice and light it falls over to the side. It doesn't get all bunched up. Just a really, really cool technique, a uh, great end result. You'll get it every single time. Hope you guys like this video. Let me know in the comments what you think and make sure you hit that subscribe button. Got a lot more videos just like this coming your way. Thanks for watching. Also guys, this free salon education was powered by my friends at MinervaBeauty.com. If you're looking to upgrade your salon furniture or equipment, check them out online.